This video app review is brought to you by the iPhoneAppReview.com. Hey guys, Philip Chan here for the iPhone app review, taking a look at an app called Uno Lingo. This is basically a crossword puzzle app, a little bit of a new generation of the crossword puzzle app, available for free on iOS, um, with the first 20 levels free. Every other level after that, you can buy them in packs of 20, or you can actually pay a um, hundred. Uh, for the 160 levels total, you'll pay 4.99, 99 cents each if you buy those 20 levels. Um, it's also available for Android and for the Nook as well. Um, nice little landing screen here with info about Unilingo, very helpful. Also tips here, just about the game. 10 by 10 grid, you've got to solve using the different letters. Um, lots of good things about patterns to look for and other things like that. And also a frequently asked questions section that's very helpful when you're first starting out Unilingo. Um, there's a little shop here, we can go ahead and purchase those additional levels I mentioned. Stats, uh, I can show you some of those really quickly and support, tell a friend, Facebook stuff. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. All right. Okay, so here we are looking at the main landing screen of Unilingo after we've gone in to actually start selecting levels. A little bit of an info right here, difficulty from one to four stars. Puzzles with a one star rating are the easiest and four star puzzles are the most challenging. Now this app's gotten a lot of rave reviews on iTunes and it's worth um, taking a look at because of that. Uh, it's, it's just, it's really done well. There's a lot of wants to try out here. So I'm going to actually reset this one. Here's here's a, the main landing screen here um, when you're actually playing it out. That's the number of the level right there, the difficulty right there. You're timed as you're playing it. You want to be at the most amount, the shortest amount of time. Um, a lot of, or the whole alphabet right here that you've got to use up here. To do so, simply drag and place a letter. Um, it's very simple, feels very intuitive. Um, perfect for a crossword puzzle game. If you need hints, you're getting stuck, you tap that right there, using a hint. Now, you are going to get penalized if you use a hint. So let's say I dragged, dragged F to there. Oh, wait, sorry. So I dragged the hint button to where I want the hint. And it'll tell you. There'll be a 30 second penalty added. Do you really want that? I don't think so. Unless you're really desperate. Secondly, there's also one called Audit. Tap Audit. This one will add a one minute penalty and will identify which placements are correct and a one minute penalty will be added. It's another one you might want to uh, hold off on. In the meantime though, um, especially on the easier difficulty ones, you can usually figure it out pretty easily. Um, just start dragging them over, looking for those patterns, using those crossword puzzle skills that you've picked up as a kid or whenever you started playing these, and just going from there. Um, feels very intuitive, controls are great, I really like it, and it's um, just really, really well done. I, I'm quite impressed by it. Um, there's a lot of levels here in the free app, uh, but once you get past those initial 20 levels that are free, um, I definitely recommend going ahead and, and purchasing at least the next 20 for 99 cents or just getting the 499 pack for uh, the next a total of 160 levels in Unilingo. Um, as you can see, you can see the numbers or the letters that are in blue are the ones you've been moving over. And you can always take those away as needed if you're concerned that that might not be the right placement. Okay. So as I mentioned previously, Unilingo has gotten a lot of rave reviews. Um, it's, it's definitely one of the best crossword puzzle style apps I've seen on the iOS. Um, and for a free app, it's really well done. Polished graphics, very smooth user interface, um, some good options here. There's the Facebook features where you can post your scores and achievements to Facebook if you like or don't like. There's a puzzle timer you can have. Uh, colorblind assist. <laughs> they thought of everything here. If you're colorblind and you can't see those blue letters, um, they'll have this with purple and yellow. That's one way to do it. And you can also show hide the completed puzzles if you want. Uh, really neat stuff. I'm, I'm quite impressed with just the overall polish of this game, all the levels you get for free, and just the variety um, here. It's a lot of fun. Unilingo is definitely an app I think any puzzle gamer, especially those who like crossword puzzles, Sudoku, or anything like that, and have an iOS device, especially an iPad. This thing really shines on the iPad, should pick up. As I said, it's available for free on the iOS and also available for the Nook and for Android. This is Philip Chan for the iPhone app review. Um, we're going to give Unilingo a solid five out of five. It's definitely one of the best puzzle, crossword style puzzle apps we've seen on the iOS in a long time. Alright guys, later.